Yo guys, what's going on? It's your boy, King07 here, back with another video. Before we get into this video, I just want to remind you all out there, the other kings and queens, and I hope you all are having a very, very best day, and I'm back with another San Francisco 49ers CFM episode. We did finish off week one with the guy conceding to us. We got the 31-15 victory, and in week number two, we're going up against the Seattle Seahawks. Kind of not the greatest team in regs or CFM, um, so it should be interesting. We'll see how it goes, but nonetheless, guys, I do run this league. Uh, right now, currently, if we go over to the members, the league is going to be full right now. We have a good group of guys, but if you ever want to join in, just add me on Discord, and I'll message you when like a spot opens up in the league but nonetheless let's go ahead and upgrade players see if we got any big upgrades for our previous game we got danny gray who somehow didn't get offensive player of the week bro he went absolutely crazy and let's go ahead and do the playmaker i've been hearing playmaker is now the best thing to upgrade on wide receivers we got i mean we got plus one release we really want to get that speed it's already 94 speed but you can never go wrong with too much speed. And we actually have a lot of upgrades to go through. Um, so I'll just show you guys the main ones. We didn't get any speed or any throw power upgrades on our players. But don't worry, our players got a lot better. But nonetheless, let's go ahead and take on the 0-1 Seattle Seahawks. First play of the game, we like to test if the bomb works. We actually have Debo Samuel in that spot instead of Danny Gray. But I think it's going to work just the same. Trey Lance finds Debo Samuel. He beats his man in coverage. Gets a little tripped up. But first play of the game, Debo Samuel touchdown. The throw, we almost pick it off with Tariq Castro Fields. He completes it to Noah Fan, and he's in our territory. Third and five. Let's see if Mr. Drew Locke can make a throw happen. The quick throw right on the money to DK Metcalf. We're going to tackle him at the 16-yard line. Second and nine. The blitz gets in there. Tariq Castro fields. Let's go. Third and 20 incoming. We're going to run some man coverage here. The throw. And oh, Jimmy Ward almost picked that off. We wouldn't have let them get three points at least. That's DK Metcalf. It's tough to completely moss him and get the interception, especially in this Madden, how overpowered ag catches are. But the kick from Myers, hopefully he's not a fake, right? Yeah, obviously not for the 20. Oh. Oh, he missed it. Let's go third and nine. Time to convert, boys. We're going to have Debo wide open. Debo secured, catches it. He picks up the first. Here's Lance to throw it. We threw a pick. Sidney Jones, the 17th or whatever he is. Uh-oh. Trey Lance. Ah, uh, we throw an interception. I took way too long to, take, uh, to get rid of the football right there. And hey, we're down 10-7. I think he's running some man coverage. He's blitzing potentially. I got George Kittle on the block here. We should have the touchdown again. Trey Lance, can he make the throw over the DB's head? He can. And Danny Gray hauls it in for the reception. Back with the play action. I'm just going to find Elijah Mitchell out of the backfield. Should get us the first, and he does just that. Yet to run the football in this game. Can we catch him off guard? And I think we did Elijah Mitchell. That's a big pickup. Big pickup on first. Money play in the red zone. George Kittle. Uh-oh. Oh, oh we clicked on again, and George Kittle gets across the goal line for the touchdown. Hey, bro. Pass leading and clicking on in this man. It's very overpowered, but it's the only way to really get your offense going with how good blitzes are and stuff like that. I think I might have missed that kick. I didn't, though. But we take the 14-7 lead. The blitz incoming and we get the sack. It's going to be Tariq Castro Fields yet again, bro. He just comes in there with his speed and gets the job done. And that's going to take us to a two-minute warning. Third and 17. The throw over the middle of the field. DK Metcalf, he's going to go ahead and convert. Dude, this is like my second or third game of Madden of the day. And I've been giving up so many third and fourth and longs lately. The throw! Jimmy Ward! He just didn't run forward to pick that off. He just stood still. And he's going to go ahead and take his first time out of the half. Can we get an interception? The throw! It's got to be Ward this time! Early breakup. He's targeting DK Metcalf. Obviously, don't blame him. That's DK. When you have the opportunity one-on-one, -on -one, just throw it up to him and see if you could get lucky. But uh, it's back-to-back. -back. Jimmy Ward maybe should have at least picked one of those off, you know. But now we're third and ten. Let's lock it in. 
Get that one. There we go. Jimmy Ward finally gets one. Can he return this for a pick six? Jimmy Ward, you just got to outrun a lineman. And he can't do it. We're at the 41-yard line. 14 seconds left. 14 seconds. Can we hit the bomb? Oh, that bomb is wide open. Trey Lance to Danny Gray. Danny Gray. No one's going to catch him. And we score another touchdown right before halftime. Take a 21-7 lead. The throw to Reek Castro Fields. An interception on back-to-back -back weeks. Could it be back-to-back -back weeks? He gets a pick six. It's going to be back-to-back -back weeks. He gets a pick six. Tariq Castro Fields is a superstar. Oh, that's a good throw to DK. DK, thank goodness we take him down with Jimmy Ward because if we didn't take him down right there, it was going to be a touchdown. And honestly, this game is not out of the Seahawks' hands because he scores a touchdown right here. I make a mistake. He scores again. Seven-point ball game. You know what I mean? So I got to keep I got to keep myself locked in and engaged because sometimes when you do have a lead, you can mess around a little bit too much, you know, and then that lead evaporates in Madden in two seconds. Another good run, though, from uh, Kenneth Walker. Second and two, can we tackle McCann Rashad Penny gets into the end zone and just like that we got ourselves a two possession ball game. Uh, minute 43 left in the third, time to lock in. Elijah Mitchell, Elijah Mitchell got one man to be, that's Jamal Adams though, he's not going to make a miss. Go pick up from Elijah Mitchell, hey, I don't run the ball often, so when I do I run it effectively, alright? Let's see if we can go, go and get, actually I'm going to, actually I'm going to do this. Let's cross him, and let's get Danny Gray all the way deep for a touchdown, right? Oh, we're just going to dump it off right here. Oh, my goodness. Elijah Mitchell just moved out of the way for a second. I almost threw that pick. We're here at a third and ten empty backfield. Obviously looking to pass after two straight incompletions. We're going to find my man Elijah Mitchell over the middle of the field. And we have a big decision to make. Do we go for it or not? I think we just go for this. I think we just go for this and try to pick up the first fourth and three, man. Block Kittle. Oof. It's not really necessary to go for it here, but if you go for it and convert, that's basically the ball game. So I'm taking the risk. I'm taking the risk. And we got our man, Debo. Oh, he holds on to it. Makes a man miss. Makes two men miss. And, get, and then gets blown up. That was certainly a tight window to throw in. We haven't really got George Kittle involved yet either. Oh, but we got Debo wide open though. I might have had Kittle for a touchdown right there. But we want to get Debo as many stats as possible. Maybe he gets best wide receiver award for the year. Can Ayuk win this one-on-one -on -one coverage? Because I'm looking for him. But we're going to have Debo instead. What a beautiful throw from Trey Lance under pressure. Let's look for George Kittle right away. Actually, no. We're going to have the man, the myth, Debo Samuel. Oh, he wasn't in bounds. Uh, let's try running this one in. I don't run often. Oh, no. Experiencing network issues. What's going on? Do not do not tell me it's going to lag out. Don't tell me that. All right, we're back. All right, the play somehow happened. And, uh, all right. That was, uh, the connection to your peer has been lost. Wow. I'm guessing the game isn't going to save. The game did not save. Oh, Madden. You stink, bro. Apparently my boy's internet uh, cut out. He told me in Discord, said his modem or something's got to restart it. I'm just a little upset because Tariq Castro Fields had pick sixes. I'm back to back weeks. That's the only thing I'm really upset about. Other than that, it's really whatever. It's just mad and stats. does not matter at the end of the day. So we're going to go ahead and advance to 2-0. and And if you guys did overall, did overall enjoy that video, make sure to drop a like, comment, and subscribe. It's been your boy, KingStar7. And I'm out. Peace.